hey what's up welcome back to the channel my name is chris and today we're going to be doing a review what do i mean review i always do reviews no today we're taking a step back and we're going to take a look at something everybody should have in their bag djs you need one of these right here This is the X5U3. Now, why did I say review? Because a lot of people are doing this review right now of these. I first purchased one of these three years ago. So this is kind of a re-review. You can see that video. Um, they're amazing. They work great. They've saved me a number of times. Um, I just wound up with a couple more. And if you're looking for something for the holidays for yourself this year, this which is, I believe, on sale already. It used to be around 200 bucks. I think they're dropping down to 175, maybe 160, something like that. I will have a link below to uh, Amazon for these. But we are going to give you an update on it and give you another quick run through on how they work because they're awesome. If this is your first time here, please consider clicking that subscribe button. Let's check out this X5 U3 uh, wireless microphone system and wireless line transmitter. Box looks like this, it's beautiful. And underneath the styrofoam, you have inside the box, underneath the bottom lid, you have your USB charging cords. Um, this is a single cord with two outputs. This is the old style USB. Everybody's complaining about it that I've seen do reviews, but I don't know why they're complaining and they need USB-C. They give you what you need to charge them. Um, works great they charge quickly and uh, no worries all right then you have your instructions audio system wireless stuff uh, looks like an advertisement for more stuff who doesn't like more stuff all right and then you have your actual manual and, uh, and then you have your your bag to uh, your bag to put in your bag is what I say because this is I carry this in uh, backpack with a laptop all right so what I'm going to do is show you the simplicity of these these are battery operated they are wireless they are rechargeable and from what you can see right here you have your mic in your line so you have a plus 10 DB when you switch over to mic so you can plug this into a nice old XLR microphone if you like um, and I do this often and then you have your power mute slash on off switch and then you have your channel selector um, quickly if you slide it on all you have to do to change the channel is push the little button you'll see the channels change you have six channels it is a 2.4 gigahertz transmitter all right mostly i use this to add another speaker where one is needed um, either to fill some sound in a large room or to use it for a cocktail hour, which is in a really close by room um, or similar. Okay, so I've used it a good 40, 50 feet with a window between them. Um, I've used it just on the other side of a wall. I've used it just around a corner and I've had pretty darn good luck. We're gonna use it to jump this speaker to where our cocktail is, which is on the other side of that curtain back there. Um, so we are simply going to we're going to take this and put it in the line mode, which you already have it in. And turn the power off. And then we're going to check on the other unit. And we're going to turn the power on. And we're going to get a green light, which means we're good. Same channels are selected. And this is my transmitter. So I'm going to add my transmitter. Sorry, this is too hard to do one-handed. We got it in here, tucked in there, upside down as it goes. And then we're going to some music real quick for you. We got some pre-ceremony music for our bride and groom. And we're gonna go ahead and walk this one to our other speaker, which is over here. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
at a curtain. So there we go. That's working out fine. And you have sound in both rooms now. And I'm playing it from my uh, from my mixing console here. And I'm going to double check it as I change it. The only thing that I would say is that the line of sight is always great. And if you can't, I um, sometimes use an XLR and drape it over the front of the speaker or just somewhere where I can sight to sight. But they are awesome, guys. The X5 U3. We're running it again for cocktail hour in a different room. And we're running it all the way over here behind this here door. All the way out to here. Working like a champ. Now I've also used it. Cheap old handheld microphone. It's a company called uh, Stageworks. Who knows? I think it was a Guitar Center cheap brand about 30 years ago, and that's how long this thing's been around. And all you gotta do to do that is click them in here, switch you over to mic, and I've used this system plugged into a single speaker walking around Applebee's doing trivia nights for about a year. Not a problem. Um, Pre COVID. Once COVID hit, ah, no more trivia. Sucks to be me. And the only time I've ever had any problem with this is if it is low and it's not line of sight and if you cover this antenna. Um, so if you give this to somebody else to speak with, doing this would be a bad idea because this will stop the signal. And then what we're going to do now is I'm going to plug in, I now have three units, I'm going to plug them in and around my home. I've got them plugged into this MC7000. I have one plugged into a speaker that's about six feet over there and I have one plugged into a speaker upstairs on the next floor of my home. Okay, so right now I am recording with a Bluetooth lavalier, but for this test I'm going to turn it off because everything is running on 2.4 gig, I think, and, and I don't want to screw up the test. So once I show you exactly how I'm doing this, I'm going to take this thing off and um, let the camera record the audio. So what we got is I have two X5 U3s right next to my friend the gnome, who's um, very happy to see you. And I have two of them wired right here. And you can see that they are selected for line, both selected for line. And I have a channel one and a channel three. I just wanted to put them here so they weren't just sitting right on top of my computer desk here behind things and in between electronics. But that's where they are. They're wired right here. And I have one, I have one right here on this little guy by himself. And the other one I have upstairs in my house. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn off this microphone and then I'm going to um, start this up again, this camera, right from where I'm standing. And we're gonna go like that. So I have some tunes and you're gonna hear that. I'm gonna turn this one off. You're gonna hear that behind me and we're gonna turn the camera on. We're gonna, well, we're just gonna walk on over. Here we go. We have source number one. Speaker number one, rather. And there is our connection. Another green light, nothing else plugged in there. Into our Maui. Whew. Sounds good. And now we're gonna go to this next speaker, which is upstairs. And it should be playing. It is. And we're gonna turn the camera around. Ah, oh, under the tree, the Christmas present that keeps giving. There it is. X5U3. And that is our input. My camera's going bye-bye. But as you can see, we are wireless. We're working flawlessly, actually. So, uh, we're working well, we're working well. So now what I'm going to do is again, no lavalier, I'm going to take a handheld, I'm gonna wire it the same exact way directly into the computer so you get a live feed. We have our mic, we have it hooked up on here, Some, a lot of the mic selected, power on, and then we have it 
we have the receiver. Now I'm going to speak into the mic. I'm going to record this on my computer. Boop. And five, four, three, two, one. We're recording. We're recording. Awesome. We have our transmitter sitting up right here. Transmitter is plugged right into my Zen Go, which is directly into my Studio One. We're going to do this without the Bluetooth microphone on because I believe it interfered with my first test. So we're going to go for a quick walk around the house. La 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 la. Walking through the basement. We're going to go up the stairs to the main floor of the home. And last time I came up, I came over to where the Christmas tree is where the speaker was on the floor. There it is down there. You can't see it, but that's fine. So I don't know if this is going to work, but I'm going to make my way up to the third floor of the house just to get more distance away and to get the exercise which I so need. So there we go. And I'm at the top of the stairs. And now we're going back down to the main level of the home. And we might take a little break for a nice little shot near the tree. Oh, okay. And then we'll take a quick walk over here. Hey Google, turn on the Christmas tree just for fun. Okay. Why, thank you very much. And now we're going to go back downstairs where we started this journey and see how we did with the X5U3 wireless microphone system and line level. So we went ahead and did the whole tour. There is the X5U3 microphone system, line level system. These things are awesome. You have many uses um, besides you can use it as a microphone backup like we just did. You can send a speaker signal from out of one of them to another one further away with no wires. You could take two of these and pretty much send the two signals to two speakers so you can have that nice piece of furniture DJ equipment with no wires coming out of it pretty much. Just your power cable which goes straight back. So you could do some you can do some cool stuff. They work awesome. Do yourself a favor if you don't already have one Put one in your stocking this year or put one under your tree because this is something that you should have in your bag. It's something that has saved me. It is something that will come in so handy. Outside they work great. Inside they work well. Um, but it's definitely saved me many of times. And right now I believe they're under 200 bucks. When I The first one I bought was about 200 bucks. Now I think they're 175 or 150 I'll put a link below, but it's definitely something worth having in your bag. DJs, have a great holiday, and we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching.